What's going on, YouTubers? It's Matthew Vic, and I got the JoJo Lena with me. And if you haven't yet, hit the like and subscribe button. And we're gonna do a review today. We have the Isuzu MPR light duty dump truck. We had it for seven months, and we're gonna tell you why we think it's the number one junk removal vehicle that you can buy. Now, this is a 2019 Isuzu. Look at JoJo, like Vanna White back there. And it's a 6.0 v8 gasoline engine and it gets about 12 miles per gallon and this bad boy right here the payload is 4,000 pounds so i can haul 4,000 pounds which we only pick up furniture construction debris we're not picking up rock and dirt so 4,000 pounds is perfect for junk removal and this bad boy has the electric tarp which you guys can see and it also has the lift gate which we got custom built, which I'll show you in a second. And also, Jojo, what did we do with these walls right here? We flipped them inside out, and the reason why? Well, we did it so that we would have a smooth the surface, because um, normally it's not smooth, it's got the other things that are on it. So this is smooth, and we did that so that, you know, you can put your logo on it. So when we had it custom built, we asked for them to flip it around so that the, what was normally on the inside was on the outside. And it makes for a super smooth surface where you can put your, you know, logos and decals and phone number, and you could just be really creative and put your logo on there really nicely. And this box is 10 feet long, eight feet wide, with four foot tall walls, which is about 12 cubic yards. And I love this thing. Now let me show you guys the inside. And now we're gonna show you things that we love about the cab. Now let's check the inside out. I'm 6'3", 235 pounds on a good day. And I got plenty of headroom, plenty of room in here. And it can fit up to three grown men. We got power locks, power windows. We got seat covers. And yeah, this thing is, beautiful inside check it out I got places for my business cards I got my cup holder I got the glove box where I put all my dump receipts at I got the electric tarp button right here where I don't need to hop out and tarp nothing and up here I got places to put gloves and there's plenty of room behind these seats to store stuff too if you guys can see I got to keep like the cat litter when you spill any oil or anything and I got some tarps back here so yeah this thing is awesome now let's check out the outside, guys. One of my favorite features on the dump truck is how organized you can be. There's a place for your brooms. Even on the other side, there's a place for the rakes. And we also have a toolbox. And we got this custom made and we're so glad we did because there's so much room to stay organized. All your tools can fit in there, your extra waters, your big shovels. It is even big enough to put your trash cans and you know you never have enough trash cans and it really saves the front of the cab from it, it doesn't get messy and so it's very organized and you know we love it extra storage space and it also kind of makes the whole dump truck look bigger than it really is so we love it. Now there's a reason why 1-800-GOT-JUNK and Junk King use these. It's because they're the best junk removal vehicle you can buy and you can send people out. Now check out the electric tarp. Check this thing out. It's all about making life easy. All about making life easy. Now I'm gonna show you something that 1-800-GOT-JUNK and Junk King doesn't have. Check this thing out. I got a lift gate button right here which we got this custom made. So I turn that thing on, I come back over here at the very back. Now this makes life so much more easier. You got that big refrigerator, you got the iron tub, and you're a one man crew that day, no problem. Check this bad boy out. This is a lift gate and it can hold up to 2,000 pounds. This makes life so much easier. So all you gotta do is pull it down, it out, throw whatever piece of furniture or appliance you have, and go up with it. Bam! Then you're done. So, 1 800 got junk, and Junk King don't have this, but we do. So, check out the back. So, this is 12 cubic yards of space. 
and we had the plywood put on here because if we didn't, it would have those pieces that are rigid and stuff will get stuck. So we had the plywood put on there and yeah. See how easy it is to get up and out. Bam, we're just doing jobs. Bam, no need for no ramp, just bam, bam. So it's all about making life easy. So one of the things I love about the lift gate is when we close the doors, it's, I'm little, so when we close the doors, sometimes it's hard for me to throw things over. So with the lift gate, we can use it as a step, and, and then I'm also able to just pop up here really easy. Um, I think having the lift gate, having the setup that we do with this dump truck allows a couple to be able to do this completely on their own. If that's your goal as a couple to do to be able to do junk removal completely on your own, this is the perfect setup for that. So hands down, this is the best junk removal vehicle you can get. What do you think? I totally agree 100% that um, eventually you should end up with something like this, hopefully. We're not saying anything bad about utility trailers or dump trailers because we've owned both and using both of those has made this dream possible. Um, definitely if you wanna um, start off with a dump trailer and then reinvest and end up with one of these, they're obtainable and you'll love it. Yeah, don't get me wrong, I love dump trailers. We have one, but once you've been driving one of these for six months, you're gonna think different and having a box truck i'm not hating on box trucks but you gotta load it by hand unload it by hand you gotta touch everything twice and plus they're super hot when it's 100 degrees outside it feels like 115 degrees inside that box truck so i'm not hating on them they're good for junk removal but this thing right here is the number one junk removal vehicle i think you guys can purchase yeah i agree so we're gonna show you how easy this thing is to turn around guys so let's say you're driving down the road you pass the address up you need to swing around turn back around Around. we can't do this with a truck and trailer but with a dump truck yes you can check this out you missed the address well no problem all you gotta do is just swing that bad boy around real quick check it out look at that look how close that is super easy no wasting time guys can't do that with a truck and trailer one of the absolute best features about this dump truck is how easy it is to drive. So you don't have to worry about sending people out and making sure they know how to back a trailer up and stuff. Um, this is just so easy to drive. And you're looking at somebody that used to have a fear of driving and not afraid to drive this. Very, very easy to drive. And you do not need a special license. Some people think you need a special license to drive this, but it's light duty, commercial truck, and you don't need a special license. And so, you know, put it in drive and off you go. Now you want to know the price on one of these things. Well, a brand new one is going to cost you around sixty to $64,000, which you're making money with it every time it moves, so it's a great investment. Yeah, and also another option is you can get a used one. You don't have to get one brand new. You can get a used one and, you know, put your logo on it. And if you want, you can add the lift gate to it or the toolbox. Those are little add-ons that you can do with something that you purchase that's used. And this thing on insurance is around between $5,000 and $6,000 per year. Which out here in California is kind of a pain in the ass when you got a US dot number, a new one. How hard was that? It was a pain oh, in the ass. It was hard. It's hard in California. So I don't know how it is in your state, but if you have a new US dot number and you're trying to get insurance in California, good luck with that. We had a really hard time doing that, especially with the coronavirus and you can't go in and do anything. You gotta use the phone. So everybody's experiencing that everywhere, but. Yeah, we had Progressive, they insured it, and then they dropped us. It's, this is crazy <laughs> right now. So we went through 15 different agencies to get insurance on this thing, and thank God we found one. So yeah. yeah, it's a pain in the ass if you're in California and you're trying to get insurance on this thing, good luck. So yeah, if you guys like these videos, hit that like and subscribe button, and uh, until next time.
You want to say anything else, JoJo? Nope. Hit the like and subscribe button and check out our other videos. And leave comments down below and let us know what are you using right now? What are you using right now to do your junk removal business? And then what are your goals in the future? Do you want to get one of these too? Or are you perfectly happy with what you're using? And we want to know what you're using. And remember, you can start from anywhere. We started with a pickup truck, then we went to a utility trailer, then we went to a dump trailer, and now we got a dump truck. And I think we'll be ordering some more of these. So hit that like and subscribe button, guys. Until next time.